hey guys welcome back to our youtube channel so today we bring to you your one and only favorite odolade or muadikola who clocked 45 today so many birthday wishes so many birthday celebrations left right and center has been trooping in on his comment session on timelines by his colleagues by fans by loved ones they've all been sharing pictures of odolade or Dikola and congratulating him and at the same time wishing him a happy birthday long life and prosperity he personally took to his Instagram page to share this lovely photo of himself, appreciating everyone who have brought him this far, and adding a caption and saying, and I quote, Glory be to God, your small boy is plus one. Your Sam Walajo is 45th. Glory be to God. And a very big thank you to every one of you. I really appreciate your support and love. The glory of God will not depart from us. In Jesus' name. Happy New Year in advance to you. End quote. This was Odunadi Adekola. Appreciating everyone around him. And letting the world know that he just clocked 45. On seeing this wonderful and amazing post. His colleague tripped to this comment section. Wishing him a happy birthday. The likes of Iabo, Joe, Kolawale, Ajayemi, Kunle Afo. Mustafa Shogdola Day, Fetia Balogun, Kemi Koredik, Kemi Afolabi. To mention but a few, I've all wished him nothing but a very big happy birthday, a long life and prosperity. The ever-loving Odola Adekola is a Nigerian actor, singer, filmmaker, producer and director. He was born and raised in Abeoko Taogun State, but he is from Otun Ekite State. He gained popularity and was widely known with his lead role in Ishola Drojaye 2003 movie, Ashiri and has acted in multiple Nollywood movies since then. Speaking of how he became an actor, Ever Loving Odolade started acting at a very young age. He said, and I quote, I started acting at a very early age whenever an anniversary was so old in our church, the Christ Apostolic Church, Lafayette Wabe Okuta. I partook in it. I had a childhood friend, Tunde, who was a part time actor and introduced me to a theater group that rehearsed near my house. One day he invited me to join the group and I agreed i went there that day and the man in charge asked me if i could act and i said i could he then told me to act like a crazy person and when i did that everybody there began to clap i was also interested in singing and i composed songs for my church but god had better plans for me he said you will still become a musician but come and join the movie industry first i joined the european movie industry in 1996 and the association of nigerian theater practitioners in 1990 I have been an actor for over 20 years and one of my earliest movie roles that I can recall is Faoraja. Bolaji Amoso, Mr. Latin produced it in 1999. I believe that Ashuri Gomino gave me my big break. The late Ishaladuro Jaye Alasari produced the movie. End quote. This was Odin Lade explaining how it all started and how fire has come in this movie industry. As we all know that Odun Lade Adekonla is not just an ordinary name when it comes to Yoruba people. Odun there signifies that this person was giving birth to during a festive period and Ade there signifies royalty. Recalling that in 2020, there were several rumors spreading like wildfire about the popular actor as he was said to become king in his hometown Otun in Ekiti state. According to The Punch, the report claims that it was the turn of the Adekola's family which is part of the ruling houses in the town to produce a king but even as the news went viral Adonai the Adekola film production boss refused to say anything publicly he neither released a statement to confirm or deny the claims nor posted any information on a social media page where he has lots of followers however Saturday's Beats findings have revealed that it is not the turn of the actor's family to produce the king of the town an indigent of the town who spoke on condition of anonymity said there are five ruling houses in the town and someone in his Odunade's lineage has been king before in recent time. It has not got to his family's turn. But if he is interested in the throne, he can fight for it because the governor, Kayade Fayemi, likes him. Presently, the five ruling houses are justly to produce the king and they even visited the governor's office today, Friday, end quote. This was one of the indigents of the town. This was in 2020 last year however another source who is a prince in town told saturday beats that adekola actually signified interest to be king but he was turned down the prince said and i quote contrary to the news that has been flying around odunade adekola is not going to be next king of the town 
he said he was interested in becoming the king but he was not accepted because it is not the turn of his family to produce the king and quote this was the punch given report on the status of kingship in Otsun Ikete state well on hearing this rumor so many fans of the actor had expressed worry about whether as soon as he becomes king his career as an actor ends some even went on social media pleading with the abekuta based entertainer not to honor the invitation to become a monarch because many of his fans still want to be seeing his face in movies. This is so true because Aduna Day Adekola is one of the big faces in Nollywood industry. It cannot be put aside or pushed aside when we mention names of people who know how to interpret role and act with all that is within them. Aduna Day Adekola is not someone that stops at where he is but rather he pushes himself to be better and do more for himself. Recalling that in the earlier stages of his acting, a lot of people criticized him for the fact that he doesn't know how to speak proper English, is not a graduate and stuff like that. But then he deemed it fit to go back to school and then he backed a degree from the University of Lagos where he studied business administration and he mentioned that he had earlier obtained a diploma from Moshida Biola Polytechnic as well. And over time he has improved so well in his diction and is doing everything to become better every day. When he was asked the reason why he returned to school and that's at that time his name has become an household name already that what was the need for him to go back to school since he already made the name for himself Adunade Adekola replied and said according to the interview he had with premium times he said and i quote i am a firm believer in knowledge acquisition so i always tell young actors who want to enter our industry to get an education first in fact if you tell me you are interested in acting i will ask you what you are doing presently if you say you are currently in school i will advise you to finish before you join the movie industry even if you are learning a trade make sure you are certified before you join the movie industry if you are seeking to gain admission into the university ensure you complete your studies first before you come into the movie industry if you fail to do so once you become a famous actor it will be very difficult for you to go back to school education is very important in anything you do in life also said as a student he had loved business study and anything that pertained to leadership and that was why he studied business administration as he is also of the opinion that studying business administration you will be able to fit into any profession. Nadia Adekola has proven himself to be a great actor and a legend in the making. He has been able to do so well for himself over the number of years he has spent in the Nollywood industry. Well guys, back to the gist that brought us today which is Odun Ade Adekola's birthday. We wish him long life and prosperity, more years to his years and God will continue to crown his effort. Well guys, there you have it. Do not forget to like, subscribe and drop your comments in the comment section below. Thank you. Bye.